Happy Halloween! <laughs> well, ladies, you're right. This week it's Halloween. So I thought, in addition to some of our pumpkin stories, I thought I would read a little Halloween, Happy Halloween story. And today it's going to be, oh, can you guess? Do you see a familiar character on the cover of our book today? Who do you see? Oh, I think you can guess. It's our friend Pete the Cat. There he is, Pete the Cat. And his other friend, other cat friend. And it's called Pete the Cat Trick or Pete. Trick or Pete? Is that what you say when you knock on someone's door at Halloween? You normally say trick or treat, but this time in our story, it's trick or Pete. Oh my goodness. Let's find out what happens to Pete the cat when he goes trick or treating. All right. It's Halloween. Pete the cat is excited to go trick-or-treating in his superhero costume. There he is in his superhero Pete the cat costume. What are you girls gonna be for Halloween? Hmm. I hope nothing too spooky happens, says Pete. Hmm, do you think something spooky is gonna happen to Pete? I don't know, let's see what's underneath the moon. Ooh, what do you see? Is that a witch flying by the moon? Hmm, that might be a little spooky. Let's see what else. other things happen to Pete. Don't worry, says Pete's dad. We have our flashlights. Let's go trick-or-treating, says Pete. Let's see what's under the, the, the light post. <gasps> boo! <gasps> it's a spider, says Boo! Oh my goodness. Pete and his dad walk outside. Whoosh! The wind rustles the leaves. Pete sees something moving in the tree. <gasps> Is it spooky? Is there something in the tree that's spooky? What do you think that looks like? The outline of girls? I think you can guess. It's a boo, boo, boo. You're right. It's just an owl. That wasn't too spooky, says Pete. Right? An owl's not spooky. It's just an owl. He's awake at night. Owls are asleep during the day and they're awake at night. And they say, boo, boo. They arrive at a neighbor's house. Pete rings the doorbell. Ding dong. He hears a strange sound coming from the door. <gasps> what is the strange sound? The, the door says, trick or treat. Welcome. Oh, it's just Callie. That's his friend Callie. Pete says, She's not too spooky. She's not too spooky, is she? She's dressed up as a witch, ready to go trick-or-treating just like Pete's. Dressed up as a superhero, ready to go trick-or-treating. Callie joins Pete and his dad for trick-or-treating. At the next house, there is something in the yard. What does that look like, girls? What do you think that is? Is it a, ah, phew, it's just a scarecrow says Pete. That's not too spooky, is it, right? Scarecrows aren't spooky. No. Pete rings the doorbell. Trick or treat, says Pete and Callie. Ooh, who answers the door, girls? <laughs> awesome costume, says Pete. Very spooky, but not too spooky. Thank you, says Mrs. Gold. The crossing guard. Look, she's dressed up like a flower. I think that's pretty cool, don't you? At the next house, there is something glowing at the steps. Ooh, what's glowing, girls? You remember we talked about things that we can call our faces on? <coughs> cool, says Pete. Jack o' lanterns! Look, three jack o' lanterns. That's not too spooky, is it? Callie rings the doorbell, the next doorbell. Trick or treat, says Pete and Callie. Oh, this door says, Happy Halloween. And who's behind this door? What do you think? Oh, it's Pete's teacher. 
One piece of candy each, she says. And look, she's dressed as a cowgirl. That's cool too. Suddenly, they hear something behind them. Ooh, uh-oh. Maybe there is something spooky gonna happen. What was that? Asked Callie. Uh-oh, look. You see two eyeballs and it's rest. something's wrestling in the leaves. Who could it be? What could it be? What is it? Oh! It's just our friend Emma, says Pete. Not spooky, but groovy. Look, it's the puppy dog dressed up in a tutu outfit. That's pretty groovy. One last house and then we'll go home, says Pete's dad. Pete rings the, ding, the bell, ding dong. Yikes, it's a spooky ghost. Uh-oh. Oh no, a spooky ghost. Uh-oh, don't be silly, Pete. It's just me, says Grandma. Callie and Pete get treats and hugs. Not too spooky, it was just Grandma. Dressed up as a ghost. Trick or treating wasn't spooky at all, says Pete. Right? It was actually full of sweet surprises. Right? Not spooky. Just full of surprises. The end. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween, girls. Well, ladies. That was a great happy Halloween story. Now, I wanted to show you a couple of things that you have in your take home bags for some Halloween fun. I wanted to show you what they were. You're gonna see them when you get them. All right, you've got, we've got several little Halloween fun things for you to do for this Halloween. The first thing is you'll have a little mask in your bags. I think it's, maybe a kitty cat mask but right here I have a little witch mask and what you're going to get to do with your mask is color it in you'll have markers in your bag to use you just color it in and there's a little string an elastic string that we, your mom or dad can help connect it for you okay and then you can have your very own little Halloween mask that's one little happy in your bag that you can make for Halloween there's another little Halloween game that you can color it's a little paddle. It's a little paddle game. It says Happy Halloween with a jack-o'-lantern on it. So all you have to do is color it. There's a little elastic attached to it with a ball. And you can hit the ball and see how many times you can hit it. Like a fun game, okay? So that's another little fun Happy Halloween treat in your bags. Another treat in your bags is you have a fun little package with some beads in it. It's a little Happy Halloween a necklace that you can make. So when you're ready to make it, you can open up your bag and there's lots of little beads inside and there's a string. I'll show you. There's instructions, but but it's pretty easy to do. Okay, you're going to have a string and you're going to have these little beads in different colors. You have white and you have uh, pink and you have purple. Okay, and what you're gonna do is you're gonna hold the string in one hand, helper hand. Just hold the string in your other hand. We'll just thread it. Okay, there's a hole, right? And you put it through. Put your bead on, and you help your helper hand pull it through to string your bead. Okay, and you have black ones, white ones, pink ones, and purple ones, and then you have some charms. Okay, they're little, little charms in the shape of a pumpkin. So you can put your pumpkin on. You can string your pumpkin on wherever you want. There's a little charm that says boo, because a ghost says boo. And you can string that on. And there's a fun little girl ghost that you can string on for your necklace too, okay? So you can string her on too. All right, so this is just a another little fun Halloween happy treat for you to do this week, all right? And there's one more little happy Halloween thing that you can do with your markers. It's a book called Orange Pumpkin, Orange Pumpkin, 
what do you see? Okay? Just like that story, does that remind you of a story of brown bear, brown bear, what do you see? Mm -hmm. Well, this is orange pumpkin, orange pumpkin, what do you see? And your mommy and daddy can help you read it. And what you do is you color it as you go along. So if it's orange pumpkin, orange pumpkin, what are you gonna color? What color are you gonna color the orange? A uh, pumpkin, orange, of course. All right. And then it says orange pumpkin, orange pumpkin. What do you see? I see a green bat looking at me. All right. And you're gonna color the bat what? Green. So it's gonna go on. Green bat, green bat. What do you see? You're gonna see a blue monster. So you're gonna color your monster blue. And then there's gonna be, oh, what comes next? What's gonna come next? Oh, a red spider. So you're gonna color your spider red. And your ghost is gonna be yellow. It'll be yellow ghost, yellow ghost. And then it's gonna be black cat, black cat. So you're gonna color your cat black. And then, oh, purple witch, purple witch. You're gonna color your witch purple. And these are trick-or-treaters, trick-or-treaters. What do you see? And you're gonna color your trick-or-treaters however you want. And you're gonna color, again, an orange pumpkin, a green bat, a blue monster, a red spider, a yellow ghost, a black cat, and a purple witch looking at me, okay? And then after you go through it and color it, you and your mommy and daddy can go through and read it, and then you can read it together. All right, girls, well, I'm wishing you a happy holiday, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.